Hi, second graders. Welcome back to Social Studies. Last time we met together, we talked about what bullying is and what we can do to stop bullying. So now that we know what bullying is and how to stop it ourselves, we need to be thinking, what can, how can we get other people to start doing these things? Because if we really want bullying to stop, unfortunately, it can't just be us second graders doing this these things, right? Yes, that's important and that's part of it, but we need to try to help other people in the school and around the world to be able to also do these things. And so I'm thinking about the people that we have been studying, right? So like Audrey Faye Hendricks, she marched, right? That's something she did. And if you think about what did she have in her hands when she was marching? She had a sign. She had a sign that said, hey, this is not okay. So what we can do, even though maybe we can't march, right? Maybe we, we can't, especially right now with COVID, like going to getting together and marching is probably not going to happen. So what can we do instead? We can still make posters. We can still make signs that we can put around the school telling people, hey, don't bully, giving them some information about things that they can do to stop bullying. And so what we're going to do today just to remind us the steps, things that we can do to be not be to stop bullying. Um, I'm going to share that with you guys, and then you guys are going to make your own posters, posters that we are going to put around the school, um, and they're going to be in all the hallways. They're going to be in the hallway, hallways with the eighth graders, hallway with the sixth graders, seventh graders, fourth graders, fifth graders, third graders, our grade, first grade, kindergarten. Um, all these kids, even preschool, we can put around preschool, and they're going to see our signs. And so we really need to be thoughtful about what we put on our sign. We don't want to make it, um, we don't want to just make a silly poster and be done, right? We really want to think about what do we want to put on our poster so that we can help other people know what to do, and we can spread the message, hey, stop bullying, right? Right? So we're spreading a message, and we're also just letting people know some information, you know, like how can you help? Because maybe they just don't know. Maybe they don't know how to stop it. And we now know. We know that information, so we can give it to them in these posters. So just to remind you, this is the ways that you can help. Get a group of friends and say something. Say, hey, stop. That's not okay. That's not kind. That's wrong. Okay, so get a group and say something. Tell an adult. Make sure they hear you and help. So get an adult. You can be kind. Find people who are alone. Bring them into your group, right? And then also teach the bully. Try to teach the bully how to be kind, how to be loving, how to treat people, okay? So those are four things you can do. So on your poster, you can use one of these things. Give them ways that they can, um, that people in our school can help with bullying. You can also have a sign that just shows like stop bullying and like have an X mark, you know what I mean? And just have some pictures that show bullying happening. Um, I want you guys to really be thoughtful again. Think about what would be help, what was, what's a picture that I can draw? What are some words that I can put on my poster that are gonna help people know what to do and spread the message, bullying's not okay, okay? So that's your job today is to make a poster. And like I said, I'm gonna be printing off these posters and putting them around the school, okay? So they're not just for no reason. These are going to go up in our school. Um, and then we'll hear from other classrooms and see what they think about our posters. I might be able to share some of the comments that people are making about the 
the posters that you guys make. So I'm excited to see the posters you make. If you're not sure what to do on your poster, ask your teacher. Make a comment. Say, say, hey, Mrs. Davis. Hey, Miss 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 Smith. I'm not sure what to do, and I'm sure we can help you. Okay. But I'm excited to see your posters, and I'm excited to see them in the hallways. Hopefully, we can stop some people from bullying and give them some good information.